Oven roasted spaghetti squash tossed with a chop of tomato, garlic, basil, and freshly grated Parmesan. How about a healthy, delicious side dish? Make this roasted spaghetti squash Parmesan. This may go down as being our easiest, healthiest side dish ever, but there's a catch. Some folks have been known to eat it as a main course. Here's how to make it. Let's preheat the oven to 425 degrees Fahrenheit. We also need you to grate up one cup of Parmesan cheese. You can set that to the side until later. Next, we have a three pound spaghetti squash. I'm gonna cut it in half down the middle, then scoop away and discard the seeds. Next, transfer it to a foil lined baking sheet Drizzle with a little bit of extra virgin olive oil, maybe a tablespoon or two. Rub the oil in, invert the halves of squash, and then send them to the oven to roast for one hour. And then, while that spaghetti squash is oven roasting, watch this. Four tomatoes, they're washed, then cut in half. We're gonna coax out the seeds and then we're gonna roughly chop the flesh. While we're chopping, let's also grab half a cup of fresh basil. We're gonna roughly chop the leaves, but not those stems. Finally, three cloves of garlic peeled and roughly chopped. Now, grab your food processor. Told you this was gonna be easy. The food processor is fitted with a blade attachment. We're gonna add the chopped tomatoes, add the basil, add the garlic, and then let's add some seasoning. One teaspoon of kosher salt, half a teaspoon black pepper, one teaspoon of dried oregano, a quarter teaspoon of chili flakes, then let's do a little drizzle of extra virgin olive oil, maybe two tablespoons worth. The lid goes on the machine. Now we're gonna pulse, but don't overdo it. Maybe 10 or 12 pulses should do the trick. Here is the consistency you're looking for. To finish the recipe, let's bring the roasted squash out of the oven. You'll know it's done by pushing on the skin. It's tender. We'll give it five minutes to cool down slightly. Then grab a big, beautiful bowl. Using a fork, we're gonna draw the flesh away from the skin. Hey, it looks like spaghetti. Kinda, sorta, sure does. And the first bit of the spaghetti squash goes into the large bowl. Add a spoonful or two of the tomato mixture. Let's also add a sprinkle of Parmesan. Then go back to the squash, a little bit more into the bowl, more of that tomato mix, add the cheese, and you'll be adding little bits of each every time until everything ends up in that bowl. It's going to yield a delicious, flavorful side dish. Final details. Add a little drizzle of extra virgin olive oil, maybe some freshly cracked black pepper. We're gonna transfer to a beautiful serving bowl. Let's garnish with freshly chopped flat leaf Italian parsley. How about a bit more Parmesan, maybe some more black pepper, then send it straight to table. And that is it. Quick, easy, healthy, and delicious. Full recipe is up for you to reference at weekendatthecottage.com. When you're visiting our website, please subscribe to it. Look for this video on our dedicated YouTube channel. You can subscribe to it as well, please. And then finally, when a side dish looks this beautiful, take a picture of it and post it using hashtag weekendatthecottage on your favorite socials like Pinterest, Instagram, and Facebook. Roasted Spaghetti Squash Parmesan. When you go to dig in spaghetti strands of squash with tomato, fresh basil, and parmesan, oh, look at how fantastic. Hope you enjoy. Mm. Really good. Mm -mm 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 -mm.